All right, Brad Johnson is very stressed out today. <laughs> Look at him. I've never no, seen him so stressed. So stressed. Um, because attack me in the because train. he's worried about what the Western Bulldogs are going to get for Josh Dunkley, obviously best and fairest. And this this appears to have reached a bit of a sticking point. Yeah. So the Lions weren't happy. Sorry, the Dogs weren't happy when the Lions traded out one of their top end picks uh, for a pick swap with the Giants to try and bolster their points to get Ashcroft in and Fletcher. And they won't be overly happy now that they've traded out another <laughs> one of their top end picks uh, to get in uh, more points. So the Lions have pick 21 currently. Now, they could trade that and maybe a future first rounder for Josh Dunkley. But the Lions currently have about 3,600 points right now at the draft. So what it means is they can match Ashcroft at pick one. That would cost 2,400 points. And then if you say Fletcher goes around the last, uh, in, at the end of the first round, it's 700 to 800 points for Fletcher. So they have enough points to match mm. both. But now they need to get a deal done for Josh Dunkley because he wants to get there. And this is going to be an issue, Jono. I think you're a bit... Uh, Dicko might want to go here first, but you seem a bit uh, unhappy with what's on the table right now, even though it's all the Lions have to play with as we sit here tonight. I'm just going to load the gun quickly um, <laughs> as I lean towards our man, Brad Johnson. He's told he's not walking back to Witten Oval. That's right. So yeah. it's got to get done one way or another. Is there a chance it doesn't get done and he goes through the pre-season? I think that I, th I think there is a chance of, of that. Looking at the the complexity of, of what is going on here, and it is complex for for Brisbane. They've they've promised a, a player they want him at their football club, but their focus has been on the the draft picks mm, first yeah. up to yeah. to allow Will Ashcroft. So I'm hearing is like Voss, Lap, and Power, Acker, and Black combined. So yeah. look out for what they're what they're getting there. Those those combinations absolutely annoy me and frustrate me more than the deals the deals getting <laughs> done. Johnson annoyed? Yeah, they do. Oh, no. but I know. Never seen him so animated. Yeah, stressed yeah. and annoyed. It's, it's, it's so wrong. <laughs> That, that's where it's 21. We thought 19, but it's, it's, yeah, so it's yeah, 20, 21. It's 21. Back, yeah. with, with the future first is something that, that could potentially happen here. Otherwise, Do they the, need to the ask dogs for a will be... Well, potentially that's another yeah. another aspect of it. It, it. This is going to go right down to the, the probably the last day, the last hour, I think, in terms of Josh. And then the, the decision, I think, from my personal opinion at the moment, you've got a best and fairest winner, a guy that beat Bont, McRae, Smith, Norton, Dale, Daniel. Like, this guy... Has, is in the sweet spot of his yeah. his career. He walks straight in next to next to Neil. So that's why it surprised me a little bit that Brisbane didn't give up something earlier mm. before the Ashcroft Fletcher scenario started to play in because of what they're they're going to get straight but, away. They can help them win a flag. But if he goes instantly, the, if he goes to the preseason draft, then the dogs get nothing for their best and fairest winner. You can flip it around yeah, as they, well. But, uh, and, and they exactly. play hard with that, the yeah, player. That's who... disappointing for the dogs mm. to, for for that to happen. But that's the. That's the likely scenario that uh, that could play out. Is there yeah. another and scenario that he could go to Essendon through the preseason? No. He tried to get there two years ago. Uh, well, I it depends on the order. We've got to wait for the draft yeah. order to come out from a preseason point of view before we have those those conversations. The dogs, for for me, would I be disappointed if they got nothing for Josh? Of course, because you you've got a guy here that's walking at top top shelf, and. You're not getting anything, would it not anything look, for him. Would it not look bad for Luke Beveridge to say how much they love him and admire him at the best and fairest and then for but them they to do. play such a hardball approach that they don't let him get to the place that he wants to go and play his footy after I, giving such good service to the But he'll the get there because he'll walk. So that's where some, something's going to have to give here from a, from a mm. dog's point of view. They, they either make the decision as a football club and go, yep, we're going to accept... We want to accept something good because you're, you're getting... He's a great a, player. A, yeah, a player of, of quality is leaving... But also, there's the other side of it where you go, you know what, Josh, you've been a great servant for us. You're a premiership player at our footy club. That's why they love him, of course, yeah. because of what he did through 2016 and beyond. And even stepping back in this year after wanting to go to Essendon, didn't happen, wins the best and fairest. Mm. So he's a guy of commitment. Mm. So that's why they love love his class. But ultimately, you know, he, he could work for I nothing. Think and, either, I, and, I, and I'm starting to accept that a little bit because think, of where it's playing and out. And I think either way, Jono, he, he won't go back to the dogs. If they block that, if they don't let, don't let him go to the Lions, then I, I really can't see him going back there and wanting no. to go back there. Not, so you've you, you asked terms. for a trade um, 12 months ago or whatever it was. Two years ago. Two years ago, thing. sorry. And now you get to a point where you've asked it again. He's out of contract this yeah, time. Yeah, you know, and that's the different scenario, isn't it? I feel like we're the dogs in the lines here, just having it. Well, I'm leaning <laughs> towards it Sarah's scenario as well. I think a player. So the Western Bulldogs should be eyeing off a player in that pit yep. rather than get nothing. So mm. something. That's why there's a nothing. bit to play. Definitely a bit yep. to play out here, and that's why it probably will go down. No, and jo <laughs> Josh won't want this, but it'll, it'll go all the way to Wednesday at what five to five or Very whatever late. it is. And he's a lot the more animated in the um, green room, wasn't he? <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 There's chairs yeah. going yeah. everywhere. <laughs> the dark. It was swear words. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 Yes. No, never.